Moving to the aviaries and open house day. June 28th, the first six cages were moved into outside aviaries. We had planned to do this a few days earlier, but there was extreme weather in Joventus, lots of rain and high wind, so we were unable to do that any earlier. Only when the weather had changed were we able to. First, we placed the cages into the aviaries and allowed the birds to adapt to their new environment. Then, we opened the bird cage doors to allow them to step into their new aviary home when they felt safe. Now, a lot more insects will be caught as they will be placed into the aviaries. Four other nests will be put into different aviaries at a separate location in Joventus on Saturday during the open house. Vitalius is staying with the first group of birds moving into the aviaries. Other colleagues are still working in Juventus with the birds that have not been moved into the aviaries. Everyone is working intensely. At about five in the morning, Belarusian documentarists making a documentary film about the translocation came to film. Then we hurried to the first aviaries because Vitalius was planning to release the first birds from the cages into the aviaries. Here is Katika and Rinukas. The first aquatic warbler has stepped out of its cage into the aviary. It was very unexpected when out of the family with the little sick bird, the very first bird to move into the aviary was in fact that weaker bird. This was especially surprising for Vitalius because when he moved the cages into the aviaries the night before, the little sick one seemed very stressed. It was very disheveled, didn't eat a lot. Vitalius thought it might not make it through the night. It was joyful to see it happy and healthy in the morning and that it was the first to take the next step. As Jimantas was photographing the birds as they moved into the aviary, one came over to meet him. We noticed that if you stand by the aviary still and quiet, the aquatic warblers come pretty close. After releasing the first birds into the aviary, we headed back to our open house at the Juventus Biosphere Reserve Visitor Center. There, visitors would be able to get to know the translocation process, the aquatic warblers themselves, and the broader conservation of the species. Visitors helped catch insects. We talked about the whole process and how the birds were brought from Belarus. With young nature rangers and other youngest visitors, we played a multitude of games.
In small groups, visitors were able to visit the youngest birds still in their bird cages and learn about all their care. Visitors could also look at the surrounding nature using scopes belonging to the visitor center. Having caught lots of insects for the birds, we set out to move the last of the aquatic warblers into the other aviaries. and we visited the ones that had been moved earlier. <laughs> 